you, Jesus. Praise to the God the Father, God the Son, yes. and God the Spirit. Hallelujah. Praise to the God who loved us so much that he revealed his redemption plan yes. by sending his one and only Son Jesus to die Christ. on the cross for our sins. Amen, 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 amen. As a Christian yeah. this week, we will remember what happened at the cross yes. and what happened after the cross. Absolutely. Death and resurrection of Jesus is very, very important to the Christian faith. Um, yes, yes, and indeed. In 1 Corinthians chapter 15, Paul explains to us. Yes, indeed. Should we read it? So 1 Corinthians 15, let's read from verse 12. Okay, it says, Now if Christ is preached, that he has been raised, if now if Christ is preached that he has been raised from the dead, how do some among you say that there is no resurrection of the dead? But if there is no resurrection of the dead, not even Christ has been raised. And if Christ has not been raised, then our preaching is in vain. Your faith also is in vain. This is such an important um, scripture for us Christians, isn't it? In the Bible, Paul tells us, Death and resurrection of Jesus is very, very important to the Christian faith. Absolutely, absolutely. reason for that is death of Jesus. His resurrection is the only solution for sinful to the sinful mankind. Yes, yes. With the death and re resurrection of Jesus, yeah. we are reconciled by God. Yes. We are made right with God. That's right, that's right. That's yet, right. yet, we look at the Islamic scripture. Yeah. We look at the, we look at the Quran, yes. which is identified as the eternal word of Allah. Yeah. And we see Islam gives the impression that Jesus did not crucify. Yeah. It's a terrible feeling mm. to knowing that if there is a book which is claimed to be the word of God, yes. yet denies the history. Yeah. Yeah. Goes against history. Yeah. yeah Surah yeah. 4, verse 157 states. Yes, let's read this. Uh, okay, it says here. And because of the sayings, we slew the Messiah, Jesus, son of Mary, Allah's messenger. They slew him not, nor crucified him. But it appeared so unto them. And lo, those who disagree concerning it are in doubt thereof. They have no knowledge, they of safe pursuit of conjecture. They slew him not for certain, but Allah took him up unto himself. Allah was ever mighty wise. There is approximately 33 to 35 Arabic words. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tells people they claim to crucify Messiah, That's right. yet they did not crucify him. Yeah. Comparing that with the Bible. Yeah. From Genesis to Revelation, Bible gives us the reasons and the details yes. of the crucifixion account. That's right. And it tells us what happened. Precisely. So, as a Christian, we ask the basic question. Yes. If they did not crucify him, yes. what happened to the Lord Jesus? Yes. We'd love to hear some Muslims give us an answer. Well, it seems like um, Muslims don't want to speak about this or they're not around for us to talk about. So, the question is, if we don't have a detailed explanation of what actually happened to Jesus in Surah 4, 157, what did actually happen to him? Where, where do we find that information from? We look into our sources, we look into, um, the, in, well, well, we look into the scripture as well, and we see what actually happened. However, which sources do we go into in terms of the Islamic sources? What, what do we look into? Muslims will go to the Tafsir. That's fair, okay. The Tafsir, Ibn Qatir is the commentary to the Quran. Do you know what? Do you... Okay, we're just, gonna ask, we're just gonna ask a question. We're just gonna ask you, hey, according to Surah 4157, it says that. Okay, well, I'll explain what it says. It says. Do you believe that Jesus died on the cross by crucifixion? Now, what, what do you believe? That's a question to you. What do you believe? Do you believe he died? Oh, it doesn't matter what the Quran says. So I take you. You're not Muslim. You're not Muslim then. 
No, no, I'm asking you, as a Muslim, your Quran says in Surah 4, 157, that Jesus was not crucified. And so the question I ask, we ask you is, is, do you believe that? Do you believe what the Quran says? Everything that's in the Quran, yes. Okay. Okay, so you believe... I'm, I'm not saying what you just said to me is in the Quran. I'm saying that I believe what's in the Quran is correct. Okay. I right. Whether you've just said it correctly or not is... Okay. We've right, got okay. The Quran here. You can we're we're going to Quran. We can read out for you again if you want. As a Christian, we just talked about yeah. how important the death and resurrection of Jesus. Yes, yes. So today, we want to find out what does Islam teaches about the death and resurrection of Jesus. I, I don't know. I don't know what happened to Jesus. Yeah. He ascended to heaven. He's, he is ascended to heaven. So what happened to the, Did anyone went to the cross? Who went to the cross? Who did went to the anyone, cross? Did anyone got crucified? Somebody got crucified. Somebody got crucified. If it wasn't Jesus, I knew his name. I give it to you. Okay. okay. So, yeah, where, you, where is your source that he was taken to heaven and he didn't die? He was, he was taken. No, you don't have to be a scholar, but... Okay, that's what we're talking about. Do you have a candidate which tells you this is the other person who died in so, instead of Jesus? What I'm more interested in knowing is if Jesus did die, as you claim, that, that, that would mean that a God has died, as you claim he's God. Say it again. If, if you claim Jesus is God, then God died in the cross. Yeah. So okay. We are not talking about. Yeah. We are not talking about what it we, we can go to that in a minute, but we want to we want to get some clarification on what you actually believe. So 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 in Surah 4, 157, it's not a very clear verse. If you're very honest, yeah. It says he died. Okay. It says sorry. He said that he did not die. Okay. He was not crucified. So the question is what we're asking is what happened? Where, which source do we go to to find out what actually happened to him? Who got crucified? Did anyone get crucified? Okay, so if so who, who? someone was on the cross, yeah. it was a peer. Somebody who committed a crime who was given a punishment of the crucifixion. So which source says that? Which source says what you just said? Where can we where can we look it up? So if one sir, what's your name? Okay, come around, come around. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, in one sense, it makes sense yeah. because you are confused what happened or who was on the cross. Yeah. That's all right because we look at yeah. Islamic tradition and yeah. then we see Islamic tradition messed up and Islamic tradition is confused. As There's well. a lot of confusion there. A lot of confusion. Somehow, we, yeah. There was someone made appear to the rest of the people mm. and then it gave the impression that Jesus died, yet. Jesus people, did not people, die. To the people who were observing the crucifixion, they thought it was Jesus. Okay. So, not, yeah. not, not, so there what, was someone what, what, what at the cross. Somebody else. There what? was someone at the cross, yeah. and then they looked at that person, and then they saw that person was Jesus. They, they, they fled and ran. Right, so... so, so they, they didn't see where, where do you get that source? Where, where is your source? What did you say? It's in the Bible. So you're going to the Bible to so get your answers. They fled and ran. There were no eyewitnesses to the event. Yeah. So let's see. Let's yes, see, brother. Yes. Can you hold this? Yes. Yes. So, so you repeat that. We just want to understand what you're saying. Yeah. We, we, we're just trying to understand what you're saying. So maybe some of your Muslim friends can help you as well. Muslims yeah. are telling us, correct me if I am wrong, yeah. that you look at the Quran, yeah. and then the Quran says it was made appear to them mm. that there was someone on the cross. You go to the Bible, and then you see the people fled from the cross. Therefore, you are convinced that people assume there was someone on the cross, but it wasn't Jesus. Okay? So, you went to the Bible. As a Christian, my Bible tells me it was Jesus who died and who crucified. Right. So, do you believe that? I go to the Ibtika here, yes. which is one of your top seats, yeah. to find out what happened to the Jesus. Yeah. So, let's see who was on the cross. Yes. He wants to know. You don't go to Ibn Kathir? I'm saying according to Ibn Kathir. I'm asking. Well, so, because Quran, which is well explained, well, the 
Mateo doesn't give you the name. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I am asking the question: Who was on the cross? Yeah. We're just trying and to do some investigation. Said, Who was actually on the cross? Yeah. And then you said people fled from that. Mm. There was no eyewitnesses. So I'm just yeah. I'm just gonna look at and yeah. then see what is the Islamic sources are telling us. Yeah. If the Qatar, yes. one thousand three hundred AD. Very well respected Muslim sources. Mm. Without Ibn Qatir, once Muslim told me, they, there would be no under, um, explanation of the Quran. Yeah. So let's see what does Ibn Qatir tell us. Yeah. Brother, do you know if Ibn Qatir confirms there was any eyewitnesses at the cross? Yes, um, according to Ibn Qatir, Ibn Sorry? Of course, yeah, we, we've studied this, we've looked into it. We want to know what you believe. Because you're the one who's, you know, we've explained why the death and the resurrection of Jesus Christ is um, so important. It's critical. And so it's important that you know, you, that you know why, Je why Jesus Christ died. Now if, you, now, if you believe that he didn't die, then we have to look at what your sources say. Okay, well, let's read. Have we, have we got that source Jesus ready? Jesus did know he's gonna die on the cross. Yes, he, he prophesied it. Willing to die on the cross yeah. so that man and woman can be forgiven. Yeah. I go to Ibn Kathir to find out actually, was there any eyewitnesses? As Muslim here told us, no, they all fled away. Yeah. We go to Ibn Kathir and then, do you want me to tell you? Ibn Kathir. Gives right, us the right, name right, of right, Ibn Qadir, give us right, the name of right, Mar right, Jesus' right, mother, Mary, who right, was at the cross right, while her son right, died right, on the cross. What did the Bible say about right, right. Oh, Mary was there in the Bible. Mary was there, the Bible, yeah, the Bible. Yeah. John was yeah. there according in the book, to the Bible. In, in, the, in the book of John, but John 19. We want to look at the cross because it is the it's what you believe. which denies the historical event. Yes. It is the Quran came to discredit the Bible. Yes. It is the Quran yes. Yes. came to attack the Christ yes. and it is the Quran yes. came to attack the Christians. Yes, yes. So do you see do you see the problem you have? We're reading it. This is not the Quran, that's the that's the Tasfir. Yes. Yes. I have read the chapter Mary. Let's read 1933. I'll tell you what to say about Jesus. Yes. Let's go to the Chapter of Mary, verse, verse 33. Peace be upon me. The day I was born, the day I will die, the day I am raised. Right. So, so Jesus himself. The day I was born, the day I die, the day I rise. Right. Right. According to Quran, according to Surah Mary, yeah. Jesus prophesied as a baby his death and his resurrection. It's true. Sorry? He's praising Jesus, isn't it? He's praising Jesus. But, but, but do, you not see, do you not see the apparent contradiction? Because yeah, there Jesus is actually saying that peace be upon, um, upon me the day that. I will die, right, I will die. Right, so he's, he's saying that as a baby. But then in Surah 4, 157, it said that he did not die, he was assumed into heaven. So he did not die. What is saying he died, and what is saying he did not die? Where did he say that? Where did he say that? Come on, I'm asking you, where does it say what you just said? Show us, show us the Sunnah. Show us the Sunnah where he comes back. But my question is to you. I have a question to you. Can you. Have you answered our question? Wait, wait, wait. You believe the yeah. that's the, that's the Bible is for the Word of God, isn't it? That's what you believe. Right, you okay, believe, of course we do, yes. Do you believe? It's yes. the Word of God, yes. Okay, who is Matthew? Who is Luke? What is her surname? Okay. What is his surname? Let's <laughs> who is his surname? <laughs> Muslims are good at changing the subject. Okay, okay. No, no. We're going to clarify. Go on, go on. No, no, no. Wait, I ask yeah. you a question. Give me, give, Sorry? answer me my question. I'm going to ask you yeah. a yeah. As we express, as a Christian, we are celebrating the resurrection of Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah! Christ is risen. Amen. For him to be risen, yeah. he was dead. Yes. On Friday, we all celebrate, we all remember yes. what happened to the Lord Jesus on the cross. Yes. He died by 
crucifixion. Wait, wait, wait. We're coming to you. Today, we are asking a question. What happened to the Jesus according to the Quran? Yes, it looks like Surah 4 verse 157 is giving us the impression Jesus didn't die. That's right. Sir, did Jesus die? Did Jesus die? No. So you have a problem. Who died on the cross? Who died on the cross? Who? Who? Listen. What, what can you how many followers you have? Listen, don't ask a question of a question. Answer the question. I'm going to ask you. Okay. No, question is very simple. Give us the, the name team. of the person yeah, who died on the cross. Who, who died? How are you? How are you? How are you? Allah can be seen. Yes. Seven to nine followers, yeah? Yes? Seven to nine followers, yeah? Yes? Get to decide. Think about the Christianity. Right, so who? Which? Oh, yeah. yeah. My way of explanation, yeah? When um, an angel given come down, when the time when the Jews come, you never talk about Jews, yeah? When it's not every single person, every prophet, you never talk about it, yeah? You talk about Islam, you talk about Jews, what they've done to Christianity, you never talk about them, you're scared. Are you answering the question or are you are you diverted to something else? Are you going to answer the question? Okay, go on, go on, go on. That's fine, just take your time, but just be clear on what you're saying. Jesus was getting rid of his group. With his disciples, yeah? Yes. Okay. How, are you? How many disciples? Seven and nine. Uh, seven and nine. Alright. Yeah? Okay. And the time Jews come and surround him, he takes it off. He had no choice. When angels come down, he take Jesus. And Jesus asked one followers, any one of you can take my image and I will I will get it in paradise. This is this. Explain, yeah? One of how he was a young boy, he took his image. So Allah, Allah was God, everyone has left him by, by, by an angel, yeah? And the guy took his image and left him with us. Okay. Okay. We're, we're going to bring some clarity to what he said. As you mentioned about Islam, it's taking bad about what you said. Tell me any verse in Mary, Mary chapter, talk about, um, about Jesus as uh, something with him. Or we are talking about his dad or something, or his his wife, his mother, uh, his communication. Yeah, in Islam, in Islam. Okay, we heard your answer. We're going to respond to you. Eh? Okay. But you didn't answer my question. <laughs> Brother, you don't run the show. No, 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 no. The, the subject's about death and resurrection of Jesus. The then we can talk about that afterwards. Yeah. yeah. Let, let, let yeah. Me let me respond. Death and resurrection of Jesus. What's your name, sir? Rizwan. 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 Rizwan, yeah? Sir. Sir. Thanks for that, Rizwan. Can you give us the story, yeah. which is very, very similar, but Ibn Qatar tells us. Yeah, it's similar to what Ibn Qatar said. similar. Yeah. yeah. But it's not exact. You didn't know how many disciples Jesus had. You said seven to nine. Because it's because it yeah. doesn't know how many disciples were there. Twelve, yeah. thirteen, or, or seventeen. 17. Yeah. So just a moment. It does matter. It's important. It it's important. In his time of need, it does matter. Explain why it's, why it matters. Yeah. You, you told us mm. Jesus asked one of his disciples mm. to take his place, go and die on the cross oh. again. That comes from Ibn Ibn Kafir. Kafir. and yeah. the young disciples of Jesus steps in and then says, I'll die for you. Yeah. Jesus is asking three times. And according to Christian tradition, youngest disciples of Jesus is the John. According to the Bible, he was at the foot of the cross when Jesus crucified. So, and then a roof up opens, Allah takes Jesus up. Yeah. So here's my question. I can't find any sources, anyone who is making call to missing persons and then saying, oh, I want to report a missing person. Who I want to report? What you One of the young disciples of yeah. Jesus yeah. got lost. Yeah, yeah. So, so, can you just explain it to me? Why would Jesus and why would God allow innocent person to die on the cross by the by crucifixion, by crucifixion, right. while Allah opens the roof of the house, of the house yeah. and then takes Jesus up? Right. Wouldn't it be perfect miracle? Allah to just open the room, take Jesus up, yeah. and then no one needed to die on the cross. Why was it necessary for John? Why was it necessary? Again, yeah? Do you understand why the question? Jesus can, why did Jesus got matter? Why did Jesus cannot have matter? Explain Answer the question. Why was it necessary for jo uh, for the young disciple yeah. to be killed? Why didn't Allah simply just assume Jesus into 
A paradise. You don't keep answer what? Question, brother, I'm giving the answer question. No, no, answer the question directly. God, we don't want parable. Why Jesus as, as a God cannot have mother? Mother. mother as a God. That's it. Why Jesus can yeah. have mother? Oh my God. Sir, you brother, should be ashamed of the statement you made. You are telling <laughs> us as eternal son of God. Has God the Father, Eternal yet God. why he doesn't have God the, God the Father? So that the is disgusting. That is just a human mind. So yeah. It's all about Muslim mind. Yeah. Is yeah. there your own mind yeah. if Jesus to be the Son of God, yeah. God must have a sex with another mother God to produce the eternal son of that, God. Is that what you say? That, 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 that is just a disgraceful. That is just a disgraceful. Shame on you as a Muslim without any shame. Okay, okay. That let's get back. Mother. Let's get back to the last question. Back to the question. What? Go on. Yeah. Why did Allah make the perfect miracle? Yeah. Open the doors of the roof of the house. Yeah. Jesus, why are you keeping 12 disciples, 13 disciples, or 17 disciples and maids? Right. Do you understand the question now? Yeah, I'm saying it. Okay, answer the question directly. Again, same again. Why Jesus No, no, you're, you're, you're trying to dive, you're trying to evade the question. Now, you see the problem, the reason why we need to know this, right? It's, it's, very, it's very important because today we have billions of Christians who believe that Jesus died. Now, if Allah wanted to deter this or prevent this from happening, all he simply had to do was assume Jesus into heaven rather than putting someone on the cross that resembled Jesus, tricking and deceiving billions of Christians all over the world to believe that Jesus actually died because we said in the book of 1 Corinthians 15 that our faith is based on the resurrect, the death and the resurrection of Jesus. And so we want to know why did Jesus say Allah, the Almighty, the All Wise, the All Knowing, assume Him into heaven and prevent the catastrophe of all these Christians that are on the way to hell? Why Jesus had to wake up as a woman? Sir, why why you're, 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 you're not even trying to, you're not, you're not, you're not even trying to engage. Yeah. Your question yeah. has nothing to do. On, your question has nothing to do. Focus, focus. What happened with Jesus? You're not, not focused. So, it's yeah. one of your response was, it was a miracle that someone else took, someone else took the face of Jesus and it appeared. So, it, of course it was a miracle for you. Allah, who made it to the history as the best of deceivers, deceived billions of Christians. Not only billions of Christians, yes. he also deceived Mary, Mary yeah. mother of Jesus. <laughs> He received Mary. You got a mom. You got a mom. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got a mom. Yeah. Every mom will tell you. Yeah. It is an awful feeling, even to think that you are going to lose your son. Yeah. But yeah, yeah. Allah, serious. Yeah. best of the deceivers. Yeah. What he did, he put Mary yeah. on the foot of the cross, and then he led, he led Mary to see it was someone else who was dying in the place of Jesus. Right. Right. So, so Mary, Mary, who grieved week after week to believe that her son died. Right. Christianity was born from the death and resurrection of Jesus. How can be son of God dies? Today, 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 Two point two billion Christians. Yeah, Christians who believe that Jesus on the death of Jesus and right. his resurrection. Right. From the first century, there were many, many people who put their faith on the death and resurrection of Jesus. But Islam steps in and then doesn't even give us the name, doesn't even tell Mary, by the way, name of the person who died on the cross. We don't have a name. Doesn't even tell Mary. Some people say Judas. Please do we don't not grieve. Know who Please do not grieve. We don't know who Mark is. Why? We don't know who Luke is. Okay. Because so, he wanted to practice a miracle. Yeah. Because he wanted to practice that the best of the sinners. Right, right. But, 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 you, but you see what she's saying. Do you understand what she's saying? Because a lot of people are deceived. If it's true, Allah changed the resemblance of the face to, um, to, to look as if it was Jesus. And now numerous people, including the mother of Jesus, Who's supposed to have her own book in the Quran? Maryam, yeah? She, she, even she was Surah um, 19. Even she was deceived. And so now she's weeping and grieving. Her son's gone. And in actual fact, 
she's been deceived by Allah, your almighty God. Do you, do you understand? Yeah. What happens to the person? It's a big problem. What happens to the person's mother? Who saw? Who saw? Who saw? Let me ask you a question. Wait, wait, wait. For the sake of the argument, you've got a young disciple of Jesus who died on the cross. Can you tell me how did the mother of that young boy felt when he saw, when she saw her innocent son died on the cross? Yeah, you tell us how it feels. Are you a parent? Yes, yeah. yeah, yeah. Have you got children? Now imagine somebody. Imagine your child, okay, had been murdered, right? Okay, and nobody, you know, and a person who's supposed to be your friend deceived you into believing, okay? But okay, right, right. So, so, so the point is, so imagine that person didn't actually die, but he deceived you into believing that he actually did die or he was murdered, and then later on, many years later, you found out that that person deceived you. How would you feel? You've been very angry, right? Right. Now you see why we're angry with Allah. Because he's a deceiver. Okay, now, now, now you're diverting. Muslims are experts at diverting. Let, let me yeah. respond to that. Yeah. I'm going to respond to your question. So, as I question the crucifixion of someone who died on the cross, according to the Quran, you are questioning the why Son of God would die on the cross. Oh, that's a good question. That's a very, yeah. very good question. Yeah, it is a good question. I didn't son hear that. Son of God. Yes. Eternal Son of God become a Passover lamb for men and women. Eternal Son of God died on the cross so that your sin can be forgiven, so that you can be made right with God. Yeah. Eternal Son of God died on the cross that you see justice, mercy, and love of God. That's right. That's right. But wait, wait, where's she still, as you fail to respond to my question, I am asking simple questions. Who died on the cross according to Surah 4, verse 157? He died. According to Surah 4, yeah. 4 157, why Allah deceived thousands, millions, billions people? Yes. What happened to the Lord Jesus? Do any Muslims have an answer to that question? But he, it, do you have the answer to the question? No, but I have a question for you. Oh, okay. When we, when we, when we get our, when we get our question. Okay, okay. Let, 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 give him a chance. Give him a chance. Give him a chance. Okay. We in life, yeah. always Christian steps in and then helps Muslims to understand their own books. It's very sad. No, no. Surah, no, no. One person at a time. What does that actually say? Surah 4, verse 157. Let's see what it says. Surah 4, 157. What does say? Indeed, we have killed the Messiah. Jesus, the son of Mary, the messenger of Allah, and they did not kill him, nor did they crucify him, but another must make a resemble him to them, and indeed, those who differ over it are in doubt about it, they have no knowledge of it, except the following of assumption, and they did not kill him for certain. Rather, Allah raised him up to himself. And much. ever is Allah exalted in might and Thank in you for so, wait, 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 wait one minute, one minute. minute. Which came first? <laughs> the Gospels or the Quran? Oh, the Gospels oh. came first. Okay, right, so we've established. I am, I am asking simple questions. Yeah, we want to an answer. And we don't want. Hearsay, what answers? Yeah. Respect my faith and respect me and answer the question. Yeah. Remember, death and the resurrection of Lord Jesus Christ is essential mm. to the Christian life. Yeah. I am asking the question, who died on the cross? You want the answer. Why did Allah... Come, come. You believe they want the answer. I do want the answer. Okay, you want, I, believe, I believe it was Jesus that died on the cross. Jesus died on now the listen cross. to me. You, you believe Jesus died on the cross? Jesus Are you a Muslim? If Jesus died on if Jesus did die on the no, cross. But you said you believe it. And he Jesus is God who is running the world. Okay. You, you said you believe it. You said if, if I believe No, 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 no. If, oh, you said if I, I believe it. Okay. 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 If Jesus died on the cross and Jesus is God, so who is running the world? Yeah, let me respond. Respond to that, yeah. yeah. We're going to answer that. But you didn't answer our question. But we're going to answer you, I but, but, will you answer our question? I, I'll, tell you, I'll tell you what I believe. 
it's not, it's not no, what you, you believe. No, 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 no. What do you, what, what does, what does the Quran teach and what does your sources teach? Your tasfir. In, in the Quran, I don't know what you're reading there, but in how the Quran it says. <laughs> how many, they, how they, many different Qurans are there? Translation. 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 Okay. Translation. So, 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 so,
I will pay zakat and I will pray. Jesus is in paradise since 33 AD. So who is Jesus paying zakat to? 2000 years. And Jesus is paying zakat. He's, he's paying zakat. He said as long as he lives. He didn't say for a short period while he's in the paradise. As long as he lives. He's going to be paying zakat. So who is he paying zakat to? It means, it means, it means. What is zakat? Sorry? What is zakat? It's charity. It's 2.5 million. Right? So he's paying 2.5% of his income of charity to, to who in heaven? Who's he, who's he getting that in heaven? No, no. Who is receiving his zakat? Or where is his income coming from in heaven? How does it work? But it doesn't say that. It doesn't say that. It is actually very disturbing. To see, no, 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 tell me. Hold on, it took too much. It is yeah. very disturbing to when see and a Muslim who comes to speak no, this Quran now. Tell me, and then where is the Quran at the Christianity? Why, why do you destroy your Quran like that? You don't, you don't care about what the Quran says, do you? Where is the Quran, Islam? And it's, it's oppressing, you say, tell me. Quran. Okay. Tell me. Yeah. <laughs> Where does Islam go against Christianity? Yeah. Quran. Islam is teaching Christianity. Quran. He said, it's showing you how to practice to Christianity. To discredit the Quran Bible. When yeah. Quran comes to discredit Christ, no. Quran comes when her to tribe. discredit are you, are you listening? Right this is very important. Jesus. Very important. So, yes. Today they ask a simple question. Yeah. What happened to the Lord Jesus according to Islam? One verse out of 6,236 verses tells you, by the way, Jesus didn't die. Mm -hmm. It is look like Allah is just dumping his girlfriend. <laughs> that, you know what? It doesn't even, his girlfriend. His girlfriend. It doesn't even girlfriend happen today. today. Yeah. When people dump their girlfriend, yeah. they don't say, by the way, I dumped you. Yeah. They have a proper conversation. Yeah. We come to the Quran yeah. and then we meet with the best of deceivers of Allah. Yeah. Deceiving Mary. Okay. Deceiving the followers of Jesus. Deceiving, her, isn't it? She's white. Deceiving She's white, isn't followers of Jesus. Deceiving billions of Christians. Yeah. Yeah. Mary the is the one of God. Jesus. Come on, no. explain. According to Christians never believe Mary is the wife of God. Oh, she's she's not disgusting. Not okay, so why, why would you lie like that? Why, why would you lie like that? No, no, but hold on, hold on. You just said Christians believe that Mary is the wife of God. Did you just say that? What did you say? No, 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 no. Don't tell us what it means. What do we believe? No, 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 no. This is why I said to you now. It's Mary, the mother of Jesus and Mother. Yes or no? Mother of Jesus. Of course we said we know. So why did you change? Why did you change what the Bible actually says? No, I'm the Bible. So that's irrelevant. So, let's go back. Yes. Your logic goes against humanity. Your logic goes against the Bible. Your logic it goes against the Quran too. Lord Jesus Christ, yeah. your logic goes against Quran itself. Yeah. It is disgraceful. Yeah. 2018, Muslims believe Mary is the wife of God. Wow. 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 Oh, okay, okay, okay. He's going to correct himself. Correct yourself. Is it, you apologize. Apologize. No, no. No, no. Okay, we'll, we'll forget it. You made a mistake. That's fine. But let's get back to some real questions. Tell me in the Quran. Sorry? Tell me in the Quran that Allah say, what we say, that Mary is the wife of God. Who are you? just telling you. It goes against the Quran. It goes against the Quran. Allah doesn't have a girlfriend. Allah doesn't have a wife. Therefore, he cannot have a Have you read the Quran? Have you actually read the Quran? So we know the Quran doesn't say that. So where did you get that from? Okay. What did you let say? Me, what did you say? Tell me. Let me okay. Let, let's let's get back let to this. Let's get back to this. My basic question. Yeah. For this Easter Sunday. As a Christian, I stand at speaker's corner. I want to know, according to Islamic tradition, Muslims are persecuted by Lord Jesus. Muslims love Isa. Muslims love the miracles of Isa. Muslims are fascinated by him. I want to ask as a Christian, what happened to the Jesus according to Islam? Muslims fail to tell me who died on the cross, why Allah deceived people. Muslims tell me, fail to explain it to me, why would someone else take the place of Jesus while no one ever called? Yeah. But you know, do you know another question we'd like to ask our Muslim friends? Because according to Ibn Kafir, sir, 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 hold on, 
According to, listen, 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 according to Ibn Kafir, it says that Jesus gave this young man paradise. Is that true? Jesus offered this young man paradise. Is that correct? According to Ibn Kafir. Right, so, but, but Jesus, no, it doesn't say permission. It says Jesus offered this young man to go to paradise because he took his place on the cross. Is that correct? Ibn Kafir. So what type of what type of man is Jesus Christ that he can actually offer someone paradise? That's the question we want to ask you guys. Uh, can you answer the question? Jesus offered this young man who chose to go on the cross to be crucified in his, on his behalf. So we're asking, you offered him Ibn Kafir. We've got Ibn Kafir right here. According to Ibn Kafir. So, the question is, what type, what type of man is Jesus if he's able to offer another person paradise? You, you're not listening. These guys, these guys are not listening. Yeah. Once again, we stand at speaker's corner. Yeah. We question the teachings of Islam. Ibn Kafir, my friend. Especially today, we question the death and resurrection of Jesus, according to Islam. No, no, I saw, no, no, no. And not even one of us who are Muslims regarding the work of Jesus. Yeah. It, are you going to answer? It is heartbreaking. What, but here is a certain question. It would be, it would be amazing miracle yeah. Yeah. if Allah just opened the roof of the door yeah. and roof of the house yeah. and then took up Jesus without killing anyone. Wow. Yeah. It would be amazing miracle if Allah just explained who was on the cross and why he died. That's right. It would be very good explanation if Allah tells you, Allah tells us why Allah deceived Mary, the mother of Jesus. It would be amazing if Allah for us to answer our basic questions on the death yes. and resurrection of Jesus. But Allah does not answer. And Muhammad does not answer. And today at Speaker's Corner, Muslims, the Muslims cannot answer. <laughs> today at Speaker's Corner, Islamic Dawatim cannot answer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As a Christian, we deserve an answer. We want an answer. We deserve an answer. And we want an answer. Yes, yes, yes. Tells us why and how Jesus died. Yes. Jesus died according to scripture by crucifixion yes. under the Roman Empire. That's right. On the third day, he resurrected. He didn't say that no. he was resurrected. Amen. Amen. And scripture gives us the reason for that. That's right. That's right. And Jesus, the reason that Jesus was resurrected is so that you also can be resurrected from sin. So the Bible says we've all sinned and the wages of sin is death. But the gift of God to all of us now is eternal life through Christ Jesus. And just a symbolic, just as Jesus Christ rose, you can also be raised to be with him one day and have life eternal through what he did on the cross. You see, you don't have to remain dead in sin, dead in your transgression. But if you would uh, uh, confess your sins, the Bible says, repent, turn away from sin. If you would receive Jesus Christ, uh, acknowledge him as the Lord and Savior, you can be saved. But it's only through his volunteer, voluntary um, death and resurrection that you can be saved. No other way, the Bible says, there's no other way to the Father except through Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Amen.